Let's start by unpacking the contents of your LED ambient tuning lights base kit. Be sure to read all the instructions before you start with the installation. Now select a location for your LED ambient tuning lights. Be sure to choose a central location to mount the control module in your vehicle, one that you'll be able to route all the cables to. It's always a good idea to assemble your components for a trial run to make sure everything fits the way you want it to. Use the splitter from the control box too if you need it for your layout. Now that if you've planned your layout and everything is working, you're ready to mount it. It's important to make sure all the mounting surfaces are clean. Use the alcohol wipe included in the kit to clean the attachment area and make sure it's completely dry. Connect the cables to the LED strips. Be sure to connect the arrow on the cables with the plus on the LED strip. Then press a piece of tape across the four pin connectors to ensure the connectors stay in place. Now position the LED strips. Applying a light pressure for 20 to 30 seconds will improve the adhesive's bonding strength. The control box can be mounted out of sight, but the eye must be visible to the remote. Secure the control box. Connect the cables as shown before Hide the wires as you run them through. Then plug the power cable in the cigarette lighter receptacle or 12 volt accessory jack. Advanced users can hardwire into the car's electrical system. Now turn it on and enjoy. Just point your remote at the controller eye and press on. The effective range of the IR remote is about 4.6 meters.